today's video is going to be a little different than what I have been posting, but I'm going to try to make my channel a little more consistent from now on. We'll see how that goes though. And focus more on photography and travel content. And this video is gonna be about self-portrait photography. So kind of some background information. I got my first camera on my 13th birthday back in 2007 and relatively right away I started taking photos of myself. Um, most of them were just, you know, kind of holding the camera, taking the photo kind of style. And eventually I kind of moved on and started using a tripod. And then in 2011 I got my first DSLR camera and I got a remote for that and that's kind of when self-portraits kind of took off and well my self-portraits that is to say um so yeah I don't know I feel like there's a lot to say about self-portraits but maybe I'll save that for another video just because you take a lot of photos of yourself doesn't mean you're narcissistic a lot of photographers that I follow are self-portrait photographers and there's nothing wrong with that my photography style is all over the place though, and you'll kind of see that maybe through this, although these are all selfies, they're all different styles and techniques. But yeah, a lot of these photos, I mean, they range in different aspects. So some of them are more conceptual, some are much simpler. We're gonna go through the years. Um, starting actually in 2008 because I didn't really have any that I found from 2007 that were decent enough. A lot of them were out of focus actually. So yeah, so we're gonna start in 2008, go up till present day. The first half I'm gonna go through kind of quickly. I don't have a ton of photos from previous to like 2011 or so, but you know, the first few photos are very cringeworthy. Sorry about that, but they do get better, I promise. I wouldn't say that I'm the best self-portrait photographer out there or anything. My photos aren't super unique, but I do like looking through them on a personal level too, just to see how I've aged and my skill as a photographer, how that's improved. So this is just like my selfie development and improvement. And progression through the years um, let me know what you think and yeah I do plan on making a video soon about tips for self portraits as well so if you have anything you want me to include in that or any questions go ahead and leave that in the comments and I'll try to include that and yeah there's just something about doing self portraiture that is so like intimate to yourself it's hard to explain if you've never done it, I guess, but here we go. I'll go ahead and show you the photos. 